she is our daughter-in-law, and we're being pleasant, and we're talking to ourselves. <laughs> I brought you back your pasta maker. Oh, thank you, Dama. Thank you. Didn't know I borrowed it, did you? No, no, I didn't. Didn't know you even had one, did you? Well, you you got me again. <laughs> Bet you thought a pasta maker was a person, huh? Would you please <laughs> shut up? Oh my God. What? You and Edward split up? <laughs> Why on earth would you think that? Well, it's obvious, Kitty. Edward's favorite chair, no butt indentation. His pipe hasn't been smoked in three days. In the newspaper, no one solved the jumble. Fascinating, Sherlock. However, <laughs> the chair is new. It arrived this morning. The pipe is not Edward's. Thomas Jefferson, we bought it at auction, hasn't been smoked in 200 years. And as for the jumbo, Edward never solves it. He just laughs at the little cartoon. <laughs> I'm not usually wrong about this stuff. That's the last of the shirts. If you need anything, I'll be at my apartment. Thomas Jefferson. <laughs> I'm so sorry. Are you okay? No, I'm fine. And I assure you, Dharma, there is there is no reason to be upset. And it's it's not so much, you see, a a separation as it is a cooling off period. Wow. Really? How cold do you want it? Because um <laughs> <laughs> forgot my pants. Dharma, dear, I, I appreciate your concern, but I'd really rather not talk about this well, just now. Well, that's what you say on the outside, but on the inside, there's a wounded little girl crying out, Help me, Dharma, help me. Well, you found me out. <laughs> now, as, as for Gregory, I... Do you I, want me to tell him? No, I'd rather you not tell him. Oh, I can't do that. That would be lying. No, that would be failing to make conversation. <laughs> well, what if he asks how you guys are doing? Then you lie. Kitty, I cannot lie to Greg. I've never lied to Greg. Never? Um, oh, well, yeah, once I... I told him I had a big O when really I had a little O, but he was working so hard. That's enough. Well, yeah, sometimes that is enough, but you've got to admit, that big O is worth chasing. <laughs> well, that's the last of the pants. Dama, have I ever asked a favor of you? Well, you offered me 30 grand to dump Greg. No, that wasn't a favor. That, that was a test. And, and you passed with, with flying colors. Uh, my marriage to, to Mr. Montgomery is in a very delicate stage, and I would like to have the opportunity to, to work things out before I bring it to Gregory. Okay. My lips are sealed. opening argument? You, you can't say this to the jury. Why not? Pete, it, it rhymes. The whole damn thing rhymes. <laughs> it's the only way I can remember it. Ladies and gentlemen of the jury, I was born in a small town in Missouri. It, it's not even true. You try rhyming Michigan. <clears throat> hey. Hey, guys. Did you uh, return the pasta maker to my mother? Uh-huh. Yeah, I did. How is she? How'd I know? <laughs> you, you were just there. Yeah, I know that, Greg. I just admitted that. I'm not a liar, okay? <laughs> okay. You know what's been bothering her, don't How you? How many times do I have to beat you over the head with this? I do not know anything about your mother. <laughs> Fish again. <laughs> I, I, just, I just think she's upset because we keep canceling dinner on them and... Mmm, yeah, that's it. So maybe we can go over there tomorrow and have a quick lunch. No, we can't. Why not? Uh, because. Greg. <laughs> I made plans to have lunch with uh, Jane already tomorrow. Really? Because Jane was just here complaining that she had to do the rest of her community service tomorrow. 
It's not that Jane. Jane Seymour. Medicine woman. Wait a minute, you know Jane Seymour? Darn tootin' I do. <laughs> Dr. Quinn, Michigan. It's... <laughs> How do you know Jane Seymour? I trained her dog. That's how I know, that's what I did. I, tra I trained her dog. <laughs> that's what I did. What kind of dog does she have? Wait, I'm not on trial here. I'm not one of your criminals in your court. What are you trying to do to me? God, I can't live like this. Wow. Huh, what do you think that was all about? Some kind of woman thing? I don't know. I've never had a relationship last 28 days. Yes? Mammogram! What? Doesn't that sound like something that should be delivered? So I figured if we just ate something together, you know, like, I don't know, this turkey sandwich, then I wouldn't really have lied. I see. Did, uh, did you happen to notice the name of the guard who let you in? <laughs> Jeff! Jeff! Yeah, God, he was so nice. Jeff. Yeah. Jeff. <laughs> so what do you say, huh? I know I seem like a big old freakazoid here, but... <laughs> it would just mean so much to me. At the risk of driving even further around the bend, my dear, this turkey sandwich... With sprouts. Quite right. <laughs> But it's not going to undo the lie you told your husband. Yeah, uh -huh, we'll do if you eat it. <laughs> when I drove five and a half hours, just take a little bite. I, I, I have a fruit salad over here. How about if I took a bite of this? Uh, it's great, great. Oh, wait, hang on! <laughs> Would it kill you to smile? <laughs> you tell me. Where have you been? I told you I was having lunch with Jane Seymour. Wow. That is Jane Seymour. I told you, I told you. She looks scared to death. That's acting. Sometimes we do skits while we eat. Where was this? L.A. You drove all the way to L.A. to have lunch? It was my turn. <laughs> so, how was your day? It was fine. I watched Pete cross-examine a witness who unfortunately was from Nantucket. <laughs> and then I had lunch with my parents. Anything new with them? They say anything new about themselves that you didn't know before? Honey, what is going on? I'm keeping a secret from you, Greg. Oh, there it's at. I feel so much better. What secret? Again with the question. <laughs> is it about Jane Seymour? No! Is it about us? No. Well, do you have a good reason for keeping the secret? Mm-hmm. Then it sounds like you're doing the right thing. What does that mean? I mean, I love you, and if you think you have something you can't tell me, then I trust your judgment. Oh, thank you. You're welcome. Wait a minute. <laughs> It's okay with you for us to keep secrets from each other? There's a good reason. Well, what would a good reason be? Well, that's usually part of the secret. <laughs> I want to admit, so you could be keeping a secret from me right now? Well, if I was, I couldn't tell you now, could I? Get a little O tonight, buddy. <laughs> hey, brought you a little 
present. Huh? <laughs> Thought you could use it as a party tray, you know? For dip. That's great. What you doing? Greg's got a secret. I'm looking for Greg's secret. I just gotta find the box called Secrets. It's a big stick. Thanks. <laughs> I'll save that bad boy for later. All right. Buttons. Extra buttons. Extra button shirts. Extra button pants. God, buddy, buy a button! Abby, Jane, you better go over here. She's back to her old tricks. Yeah, straight sugar. Right out of the stick. <laughs> Dharma, how much sugar have you had? I can't talk, no. I gotta find great secret. You've been up all night doing pixie sticks. Did you find any Pez paraphernalia? Barry, that's our daughter. I have to ask. I gotta find it, I gotta find it, I gotta, I gotta find it. All right, you, brew me some chamomile tea strong. You get me two aromatherapy candles, sandalwood, or eucalyptus. Dharma. <laughs> You're probably asking yourself, why are you doing this, Dharma? That's the question I'd be asking myself. Dharma, why are you doing this? Thank you for asking. <laughs> I'm doing this because my marriage is in trouble with the capital T, which rhymes with pool, and I don't know how that could be. Dharma, Dharma. Breathe with me, baby. Remember, a deep cleansing breath. Come on, one, let's do it in. And in. And exhale. Ah. Oh, gee. All right, help me get her up. Help me get her up. Stay with us, baby. Stay with us, baby. You know, this is your fault, Jane. She didn't need sugar before she met you. Hey, nobody put a gun to her head. <laughs> Dharma, talk to me. Good ship, lollipop. <laughs> Look what I found. Oh, what a beautiful necklace. Oh, my God, that's Greg's secret. It's probably for tomorrow. Well, what's tomorrow, baby? Our half year anniversary. Really? <laughs> How long have you guys been married? Six months, Larry. You have your good days and your bad days, don't you? Sure. So which is this? Which is this what? Got it. See, Dharma, everything's okay. It's not, because now Greg's gonna give it to me and I'm gonna have to tell him that I went through all of his stuff and found it already. Or you could just shut up and act surprised. I can't do that, Jane. That's worse than lying. That's... that's acting. <laughs> I'm back. Oh, God, what now? Okay, you've got to teach me how to act surprised so that my husband won't know that I went through all of his stuff. Tell me, my dear, is he a real husband or is he a husband like I'm your friend? <laughs> yeah, I, okay, I know I sound crazy, but I'm just really upset and I haven't eaten anything in the past 24 hours except for pixie sticks. <laughs> what is a pixie sticks? Paper tubes filled with sugar and artificial flavor. Really? Want to try one? Come in. Oh, you are brilliant! After a dozen or so, you feel like you're riding a horse? <laughs> Let's get back to this. Now, I I'm, I'm your husband. Dharma, I have purchased something for hey, you. Hey, you wouldn't say purchased. Fine, fine. Dharma, I have acquired something for you. Acquired? Just, just do it, you... Dharma, this is for you. No, 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 that, that's, that's frightened, like seeing a ghost, no? Nope. Try seeing a necklace. What's frightening about seeing a ghost? All right. But it better still, just repeat after me. Oh, Gregory, that's absolutely magnificent. Oh, Gregory, that's absolutely magnificent. <laughs> Not with the accent, you silly twit. I'm not using an accent. Yes, you are. Well, you started it. But I'm alive in English. Here's your mineral water. Wow, mineral water. 
Isn't this what you ordered? Why did I seem surprised? Yes. Well, I wasn't. I was acting. I left L.A. to get away from you people. Hi. Sorry I'm late. I had to uh, stop home and pick something up. Really? What? Well, do you know what today is? No! It's our six-month anniversary, and I got you a little something. What's this? Open it up. A pasta maker. <laughs> So you don't have to keep borrowing the one from my parents. The pasta maker. Open it up. I think you'll like the instructions. <laughs> what could this be? Dharma, stay back. All clear. Boy, I don't know if these things are worth the convenience. Larry, I told you a million times the microwave isn't going to hurt you. Yeah, well, better safe than sterile. Is Abby around? I need to talk to her. She's out. Are you okay? No, I'm not. I really need to talk to Abby. You know, honey, when you have problems, you can always talk to me, too. Oh, I know. Thank you. Did she mention when she was coming back? Probably. <laughs> Is this about Greg? Did he give you the necklace? No. He gave me this bracelet. I think he got the necklace for somebody else. Oh, no, honey. There are probably a million logical explanations. Like what? Like, uh, maybe he bought it for himself. Maybe he enjoys wearing women's jewelry. Larry! I didn't say clothing. I said jewelry. <laughs> or, or, or maybe it was the only way he could prove he was on the Titanic. <laughs> You're right. There are lots of explanations. So, you feel better, Pumpkin? Yeah. Thank you. Now, think really hard, Larry. When's Abby coming home? <laughs> well, thanks for calling, Larry. I was worried about her. No, no, I, no I'm, I'm pretty sure you called me. <laughs> oh, uh, actually, she's walking in right now. No, no, no. She's walking in here. <laughs> I gotta go. Bye. Okay. I'm just going to come out and say it. I found the necklace. What necklace? The pearl necklace. The pearl... You were going through my stuff? What were you doing going through my stuff? This isn't about me. This is about you. What's the deal with the necklace? It's for you. Uh, what, for next Christmas or uh, something? Probably, or Valentine's Day. Oh, you expect me to believe that you buy gifts a year in advance? I, I do. Oh, God, you do. <laughs> of course you do. That's exactly what you do. I suck. <laughs> I'm so sorry. I'm so, like, you know when you accidentally hit a guy in a crosswalk? Sorry, like, so sorry. I forgive you. Really? Yes. Craig, the secret's driving me crazy. Look, why don't you just tell me what it is? Because I promise not to say anything. All right, well, how about this? How about we play charades and I guess? That's good. Thank you. <laughs> I'm really good at charades. Yeah, you think you're good. What do you see me? Okay. Go! Okay. 
Four words. Me. My. 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 My bird. My. Uh, my. Me. My. My eagle. My. 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 My pigeon. My. Uh, my. 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 Left foot. My pirate. My pi pirates of Penzance. Oh, Darwin, did you scratch my pirates of Penzance album? <laughs> A uh, pair of ants. A uh, 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 pair of ants. A pair of ants. A pair of ants. Arsenic and old lace. Yes. <laughs> no. <laughs> egg. Eggy. Eggy. Eggs. Egg white. Egg white. Egg yolks. Yolks. Uh, my yolk. Uh, my yolk. Are separated. My yolks are separated. Why is that a secret? You know I like my omelets without the cholesterol. You're in pain. You're in pain. You're tired. Uh, you ah pillow. Uh, uh. Broke up. Broke up. How hot is that? Wow. You are so good. <laughs> You're coming with me to San Francisco. I can't. I've got a show to do. It's your turn. Go. <laughs> it's four to six foot. Told you. She looks scared to death. <laughs> Where was this? L.A. You drove all the way to L.A. to have lunch? It was my turn. <laughs> so how was your day? It was fine. I watched Pete cross-examine a witness who unfortunately was from Nantucket. <laughs> and then I had lunch with my parents. Anything new with them? They say anything new about themselves that you didn't know before? Honey, what is going on? I'm keeping a secret from you, Greg. Oh, there it's at. I feel so much better. What secret? Again with the question. <laughs> is it about Jane Seymour? No! Is it about us? No. Well, do you have a good reason for keeping the secret? Mm-hmm. Then it sounds like you're doing the right thing. What does that mean? I mean, I love you, and if you think you have something you can't tell me, then I... Lollipop! <laughs> Look what I found. Oh, what a beautiful necklace. Oh, my God, that's Greg's secret. Probably for tomorrow. Well, what's tomorrow, baby? Our half year anniversary. Really? How long have you guys been married? Six months, Larry. You have your good days and your bad days, don't you? Sure. So which is this? Which is this what? Got it. See, Dharma, everything's okay. It's not, because now Greg's going to give it to me, and I'm going to have to tell him that I went through all of his stuff and found it already. Or you could just shut up and act surprised. I can't do that, Jane. That's worse than lying. That's... that's acting. <laughs> I'm back. Oh, God, what now? Okay, you've got to teach me how to act surprised so that my husband won't know that I went through all of his stuff. Tell me, my dear, is he a real husband, or is he a husband like I'm your friend? <laughs> yeah, I, okay, I know I sound crazy, but I'm just really upset and I haven't eaten anything in the past 24 hours except for pixie sticks. <laughs> what is a pixie sticks? Uh, paper tubes filled with sugar and artificial flavor. Really? Want to try one? <laughs> Come in. Kitty, I'm so sorry. Are you okay? No, I'm fine. And I assure you, Dharma, there is, there is no reason to be upset. And it's, it's not so much, you see, a, a separation as it is a cooling off period. Wow. Really? How cold do you want it? Because, um... <laughs> <laughs> Forgot my pants. 
Dami, dear, I, I appreciate your concern, but I'd really rather not talk about this well, just now. Well, that's what you say on the outside, but on the inside, there's a wounded little girl crying out, Help me, Dharma, help me. Well, you found me out. <laughs> now, as, as for Gregory, I... Do you I, want me to tell him? No, I'd rather you not tell him. Oh, I can't do that. That would be lying. No, that would be failing to make conversation. <laughs> well, what if he asks how you guys are doing? Then you lie. Kitty, I cannot lie to Greg. I've never lied to Greg. Never? Um, oh, well, yeah, once I... I told him I had a big O when really I had a little O, but he was working so hard. That's enough. Well, yeah, sometimes that is enough, but you've got to admit, that big O is worth chasing. <laughs> well, that's the last of the pants. Dama, have I ever asked a favor of you? Well, you offered me 30 grand to dump Greg. No, that wasn't a favor. That, that was a test. And, and you passed with, with flying colors. Uh, my marriage. Good boy for later. All right. Oh. Buttons. Extra buttons. Extra button shirts. Extra button pants. God, buddy, buy a button! Abby, Jane, you better go over here. She's back to her old tricks. Yeah, straight sugar. Right out of the stick. <laughs> Dharma, how much sugar have you had? I can't talk, no. I gotta find great secret. You've been up all night doing pixie sticks. Did you find any Pez paraphernalia? Perry, that's our daughter. I have to ask. <laughs> I gotta find it. I gotta, I gotta find it. All right. You, brew me some chamomile tea strong. You, get me two aromatherapy candles, sandalwood, or eucalyptus. Dharma. <laughs> You're probably asking yourself, why are you doing this, Dharma? That's the question I'd be asking myself. Dharma, why are you doing this? Thank you for asking. <laughs> in trouble with the capital T, which rhymes with pool, and I don't know how that could be. Dharma, Dharma, breathe with me, baby. Remember, a deep cleansing breath. Come on, one, let's do it in. And in... Did you find any Pez paraphernalia? Perry, that's our daughter. I have to ask. I gotta find it, I gotta find it, I gotta, I gotta find it. All right, you, brew me some chamomile tea strong. You, get me two aromatherapy candles, sandalwood, or eucalyptus. Dharma. <laughs> <laughs> You're probably asking yourself, why are you doing this, Dharma? That's the question I'd be asking myself. Dharma, why are you doing this? Thank you for asking. <laughs> in trouble with the capital T, which rhymes with pool, and I don't know how that could be. Dharma, Dharma, breathe with me, baby. Remember, a deep cleansing breath. Come on, one, let's do it in. And in, and exhale. Ah. Oh, geez. All right, help me get her up. Help me get her up. Stay with us, baby. Stay with us, baby. You know, this is your fault, Jane. She didn't need sugar before she met you. Hey, nobody put a gun to her head. <laughs> Come on, Dharma, talk to me. Good ship, lollipop. <laughs> Look what I found. Oh, what a beautiful necklace. Oh, my God, that's Greg's secret. It's probably for tomorrow. Well, what's tomorrow, baby? Our half year anniversary. <laughs> you, you were just there. Yeah, I know that, Greg. I just admitted that. I'm not a liar, okay? <laughs> okay. You know what's been bothering her, don't How you? How many times do I have to beat you over the head with this? I do not know anything about your mother. <laughs> Fish again. <laughs> I, I, just, I just think she's upset because we keep canceling dinner on them and... Mmm, yeah, that's it. So maybe we can go over there tomorrow and have a quick lunch. No, we can't. Why not? Uh, because. Greg. <laughs> I made plans to have lunch with, uh, Jane already, tomorrow. Really? Because yeah. Jane was just here complaining that she had to do the rest of her community service tomorrow. Got that, Jane. 
Jane Seymour. <laughs> Medicine woman. Wait a minute, you know Jane Seymour? Darn tootin' I do. <laughs> Dr. Quinn, Michigan. It's... <laughs> How do you know Jane Seymour? I trained her dog. <laughs> that's how I know, that's what I did. I, tra I trained her dog. <laughs> that's what I did. What kind of dog does she have? Wait, I know. 